On these time of flight MRI images, we see an anomalous vessel coursing from the right cavernous internal carotid artery to the basilar artery. This is a persistent trigeminal artery and represents the most common of a number of the classic persistent carotid basilar anastomoses. As seen here, the basilar artery caudal to the junction with this vessel is often hypoplastic. This vascular anomaly has been cited as occurring in less than 1% of cerebral angiograms and courses along the pathway of the trigeminal nerve. Although this is in general an incidental finding of little clinical significance, it can be associated with the aneurysms, so the course of the vessel should be closely scrutinized. The remaining defined persistent carotid basilar anastomoses include the persistent otic artery that maintains a connection at the level of the petrous ICA via the internal auditory canal, and is thought to be very rare. The persistent hypoglossal artery at the C1-C2 level that maintains a connection via the hypoglossal canal and the proatlantal intersegmental artery at the C2-C3 level. Lastly, unrelated to the persistent trigeminal artery, we see a pontine cavernoma in this case as well.